Over the years, we've highlighted a number of programs bridging the generation gap with music, education, art, and activities. This morning, Taj Mahal shares the intergenerational benefits experienced between a neighboring school and senior care community in New Berlin. Each week, students at New Berlin Eisenhower Middle School take a field trip. It's a short one, just across the parking lot to Elizabeth Residence, a senior living facility next door. Tracy Hahn is a special education assistant at the school. She says the relationship between the facility and the school has been a rewarding one. Well, actually, pre-COVID, we kind of set up a little relationship when um, this building was built, thinking it's such a it's such an easy thing to do. We can just walk over, and it's like a win-win because the youth get to interact with the elderly, and I'm sure that they and, you know, enjoy having the kids here. Does everyone know how to play Uno? During their flex period, students walk over to meet with the residents. They read together, play games, and sit and talk, getting to know one another. I'm going to give everybody seven cards. Students like eighth grade Colin Filkins say they enjoy the visits. It's very social. Everyone's nice. It's, I like being able to know that I made someone happy today. This means plus two. Other students feel the same. Which means you have to draw two. Naomi Jacobson says visiting here is something she looks forward to. We get a break just from school and stress and everything like that. And I think it's just important to talk to people, get to know everybody here. Yeah. The best part about the dedication from students to these visits is that it's all on a volunteer basis and school administrators say they are pleased that so many students sign up to participate each week. They come over and sometimes they get some good stories from the older people and I think they just bring in a little energy and they love to play the games. Uno, beat that, bingo. Those are just some of the games they play. I've noticed that, you know, when you give these kids present them with some good things to do. They're just ready to jump on board about it. Yeah. Ooh, six, six, I would keep that. That's I a winning that. number. You'll get a variety of kids. Some kids come almost every week. The residents here also get a lot out of these visits. So we have 30 residents here in the facility. Lovely Murray is the resident manager. She says since the students began their visits here, the response from the residents has been positive. For the residents, it's more so like to socialize with kids because you, you barely see any kids coming into a facility. So when they see the kids coming, um, the kids love their stories that they tell too. And then they just love it. Just more nurturing part and the sense of just socializing with the, re the residents and um, the students. I love knowing to myself that I'm the reason why people are happy or I brought someone's day up when they could have been in a bad mood. So it definitely does make me feel better about myself and it definitely does make my day better as well. I think it helps them because um, they just get to talk to anybody in the community, get to know students at Eisenhower more. Naomi says she has many memories from her visits. It's interesting to just know how they live and what they do. I talked with um, a resident named Ginny, um, Jeannie, I think, and she was always telling us about how she was sick a lot of her life and how she's always wanted to see a bunch of things but never really got the opportunity. So my friend Dia and I would always come here and tell her about things that we've seen, just sharing experiences. Passing knowledge, experience, and a little fun each week. The program is a partnership that both the facility and school say they're excited to continue in the coming years. We just have to put more um, trust into our youth. I think if we give them opportunities to do good things, they have good hearts and they want to do it. We just have to give them the opportunities.